Your Total Sports Network, three times better and still growing strong. ESPN. Sometimes late in the evening, an emotion begins to stir in men. A craving for excitement that can be satisfied only one way. ESPN, the 24-hour cable sports network. Big-time sports like college football and basketball, NBA basketball, professional boxing, auto racing, something exciting and even at 1 in the morning. ESPN, the 24-hour cable sports network where the cheering never stops. Network presents the Canadian Football League Eastern Division Final. Today's CFL action is brought to you by Chevy Trucks and your local Chevrolet dealer who invite you to see the new Chevy S10S for 1983. And by the Hilton Hotel Corporation. When American business hits the road, American business stops at Hilton. Hilton, America's business address. And by Budweiser Light. When you bring out your best, you deserve ours. you ever heard about pickups and meet the revolutionary new size Chevy S10. There's never been a truck like it before. Chevy S10. 28 miles per gallon. 39 highway. The standard four-cylinder engine has higher EPA gas mileage ratings than any of the best-selling imports. Chevy S10. It offers optional V6 power. Power to tow twice as much as any import pickup. Test drive the new size Chevy S10 today. There's never been a truck like it before. Never. Chevy is the power in trucks. Off the white belly jet that lands me To a hotel that understands me I've got business and I'm on the road again Feeling the pressure mounting on me Counting the people counting on me Competition like I can't remember when And you can reach me at the Hilton Just call me at the Hilton And we'll get down to your business right away When American business hits the road American business stops at Hilton America's business address Born of tradition, nurtured by pride, Budweiser Light with a clean, distinctive taste, a light beer worthy of the king of beers. Bring out your best. Bring out your best. The best never comes easy. Budweiser Light. That's why there's nothing else like it. It's another great week of college football, 82 on ESPN. Sunday morning, Coach Lou Holtz leads Arkansas against Tulsa. Sackmaster Billy Ray Smith heads the Razorback defense charge against an upset-minded Golden Hurricane. And the Oklahoma Sooners unleash their high-powered wishbone offense for an ESPN 82 season debut. But they'll need defense, too, if they're going to get by a determined squad of West Virginia Mountaineers. Does Nebraska have the horses to capture a national championship? Quarterback Turner Gill leads a star-studded backfield against Iowa. Can the Hawkeyes upset the Cornhuskers again this year? ESPN's got the answer with College Football 82. Join us. Cats in this game. Their owner, Harold Ballard, told them, if you win, I'll take you out on the town. But the 80-year-old owner also said, you'll have to take me with you. I don't know if they will. He might uh, drive them right through the whole night and be the last one to give up. Holloway wants the throw. Does to Paul Pearson, and Pearson makes the catch for a gain of six. A screen pass to the big guy from Queens University, Bob Bronk. Well, one of Pat Marston's favorite newcomers in the league this year, Bob Bronk, took a screen pass. I'll tell you, that he didn't even wait for his lineman to set it up for him. He was so open. That's what happens when Hamilton got caught in that man-to-man -man coverage. The defensive backs were deep. That Conrad Holloway laid that ball in perfectly. Terry Greer getting in behind Leroy Paul. One of the things Holloway told me this week, he said, we feel we can work on Leroy Paul with Terry Greer. He's bigger than he is. He can go up and get the ball, and what an example of that. He just showed us right there. Sixth touchdown of the year for Terry Greer. The point after by Andrew Session is good. 
And the Argos on their first possession of the ball game go for the touchdown, and they lead the Hamilton Ticats 7 0. We'll be back in just a moment. Words do it yourself sound better with every repair bill. You know you need the right tools to do the right job. One tool above all deserves your attention now. It's called the Family Handyman. It's the practical do-it-yourself magazine with mind-jogging articles and step-by-step -step procedures for maintaining and improving your home. The people you read about are people like you. When you see how they did it, you'll know why you can do it and save. Professionals charge more than $13 an hour. Why settle for that when a year's subscription is only $9.95? You save over $5 off the newsstand price. Plus, you get this free guide to emergency home repairs that could save you hundreds of dollars. So call the family handyman now and nail down a bargain today. Call toll-free 1-800-544-2000. That's 1-800-544-2000. One year, 10 issues is only $9.95 and satisfaction is guaranteed. Call today, we'll bill you, or you can use your credit card. 1-800-544-2000. From Texas Southern University, the four-year pro, Terry Greer, gets his sixth touchdown reception of the year. And gives... They're always good when you're a receiver, but really, I think, look, this only a ball touched the ground. Marks, uh, Braganola is awfully upset. He feels he made the catch. Maybe we'll see from this angle. If he made it, it was a heck of a catch. But I don't know. I think from that angle, it looked like it was a pretty good catch, and maybe Mark had something to be upset about. It's like receiver's drama school, isn't it, Lee? <laughs> well, you got to let the referee know you're a little upset with the call every once in a while, Bill. From the 44-yard line, Bernie Ruoff tries the field goal. And it is good. The Hamilton Ticats have hit the scoreboard. On a 44-yard field goal by Bernie Ruoff, Bud Riley has to be a little more pleased. At least they had a good march. They moved from their 30-yard line all the way down into Toronto Territory. And though they didn't get the major score, they got the field goal. So now it's Toronto 7, Hamilton 3. We'll be back in just a moment. Hey, champ, got a heavy beard? Get ready for a knockout of a shave. Introducing the heavyweight, new Nakzima. You've got heavy cream. Heavy moisturizers, a new protected formula, close, comfortable shades. For the roughest beards, take on the heavyweight new Nagzima, and your face comes out the winner. Henry Larson is terrified. He won't wake up tomorrow morning. You see, Henry doesn't trust his old alarm clock to wake him up on time. Now there's Timex alarm clocks. Timex, a name you trust for rugged dependability. 69 styles priced from only $6.95. After all, before it wakes you up, an alarm clock has to let you go to sleep. Timex, the wake-up that won't let you down. A crowd somewhere around 50,000 here at Exhibition Stadium in Toronto. They're seeing a dandy, at least in the first half of this first quarter, as Bernie Ruoff kicks it away, and this is Cedric Mitter, starting from his 23. And Mitter picks his way out over the 35 to about the 37-yard line. So now it's incumbent upon the Hamilton defense to stop Toronto. The first time the Argos got their hands on the football, they went for the major score. Well, you know, a lot of people have different opinions about the two-week layoff, and we had a chance to ask Conrich Holloway. Third down, and Andrew Sisson will be punting for the first time in the game. I hope you weren't that hard on me when I was playing. I was. Bruce. The ball bounces beyond David Shaw, and it will go for a single point. Andrew Sisson gets the single point, and the Argos go out in front of Hamilton 8-3. to three. We'll be back in just a moment. It's back for a second great season on your Total Sports Network. The NFL Game of the Week starting Saturday on ESPN. It's another great week of college football, 82 on ESPN. Sunday morning, Coach Lou Holtz leads Arkansas against Tulsa. 
Sackmaster Billy Ray Smith heads the Razorback defense charge against an upset-minded Golden Hurricane. And the Oklahoma Sooners unleash their high-powered wishbone offense for an ESPN 82 season debut. But they'll need defense, too, if they're going to get by a determined squad of West Virginia Mountaineers. Does Nebraska have the horses to capture a national championship? Quarterback Turner Gill leads a star-studded backfield against Iowa. Can the Hawkeyes upset the Cornhuskers again this year? ESPN's got the answer with College Football 82. Join us. Your Total Sports Network. Three times better and still growing strong. ESPN. Along with the Argos as they go on defense now, leading 8-3, to three, and Hamilton takes possession at their 35-yard line. Clements quickly to DiPietro. DiPietro has the first down over the 45 to about the 49-yard line. Zach Henderson cut the legs out from under him, number 31. But, you know, we call this a shootout. That's kind of prophetic because with the exception of Hamilton's first possession, the teams have scored points every time they've had the ball. Well, I'm not surprised when you put two good offenses together in one game as we have here tonight, you're going to see a lot of points scored. And Rocky DiPietro, very dependable performer for the Ticats. First down, Hamilton at their 49-yard line. Clements throwing it up for Keith Baker, but he wasn't set. A flag comes down, and Don Rose is going to be called. Bertie Ruoff will try his second field goal of the ball game from the 38-yard line. And it's good. A line drive shot that just cleared the bar. It came out of there like a rifle shot. And so Ruoff quarter comes to an end with the Toronto Argonauts out in front of the Hamilton Ticats, 8-6. to six. We'll return with the second quarter in a moment. <laughs> it's ready! I found the way to the gold. Pitfold by Activision? Quick, to the Atari video computer system. Uh, Here, show us. First, climb down the underground passage. Oh, yeah. Leap over scorpions. Oh, set. Yes. Swing over the swamp. Claw the There. The gold. Ah. <laughs> Did I mention the targets? <laughs> Pitfall, a jungle adventure game designed by David Crane from Activision. Hey, Frank. Want to wager on the race? For a case of beer? Sure. What's your brand? These boats will cover 200 miles before this wager is settled, but it's worth the wait, because it's for Michelob Light, that rich, smooth taste you can compare to any beer you like. You never beat us that bad before. <laughs> we never raced for a whole case of Michelob Light before. Michelob Light. Compare the taste. I'm Johnny Bench. This is Krylon Spray Paint, the other leading national brand. And here comes my fast pitch, so watch close. Krylon Special Formula goes on smooth, just like a professional finish. And just 12 minutes later, it's dry to the touch. No runs, no drips, no errors. The other brand's still tacky after one hour. Let's see it again. Krylon dry after 12 minutes. Other brand's still tacky after one hour. Did you catch that? Krylon, for a smooth, fast professional finish. Oklahoma's Zach Henderson, an old teammate of yours with Hamilton. What a season he's had with the Argos. It is second down, Toronto, second and 20, as Martin Cox takes that flanker screen and gets inside the 20 to about the 19. The Argos will be short by about eight yards of the first down, as Carm Cartieri, 47, and Mike McIntyre, 26, are there to make the stop. You'll notice that Wilfred Simon's going back in. He was out for a little bit, and the uh, problem was that he injured his left arm. It was just a bit of a crack above the elbow, but he appears to be fine. I think that showed the experience of Conrad Holloway. You know, he had second and 20-odd yards to go for a first down, and rather than maybe force an interception deep just trying to pick up the first down, he got some yardage back, and at least it sets up a field goal attempt by his kicker, and they're not forsaking any points in this case. The field goal by Andrew Session from 26 yards is good. And the Argos go out in front of the Hamilton Ticats. Right on the money, and B.P. Etro hauls it in for his second touchdown pass of the year. A 
Well, as you can see, there's a lot of people that have made the drive over from Hamilton tonight to Exhibition Stadium. They're on their feet. They're happy because Tom Clements is hooked up with number 23, Rocky DiPietro. One of the problems the Ticats have been having is scoring touchdowns. They have to get more production from DiPietro. They've got it tonight in the second quarter, a 29-yard touchdown. The first major score for the Ticats, but it puts them into the lead. And Bernie Ruoff's point after is good. And so now Hamilton goes out in front of the Argos, 13 to 11 for the first time in this ball game. And when we look to our Panasonic play of the game, at the end of the game, we'll have to look possibly at the touchdown by Rocky DiPietro putting the Ticats into the lead. All right, it's Hamilton 13, Toronto 11. We'll be back in just a moment. The season is right for professional football from Canada. The passing. The scoring. The all-out wide-open game. It's here for a third straight year. The CFL, only on your Total Sports Network, ESPN. There's a lot about the business world you can't learn in any textbook. You learn it here, the Wall Street Journal. Today's business, always current, always timely. Believe me, it's required reading. Get all the business news you need when you need it. Get the Wall Street Journal. Delivered every business day for six months for $47. Just 37 cents a day. Phone toll free, 800-228-3300. That's six months, $47, only 37 cents a day. Phone 800-228-3300 now. Bernie Roaf is set for the kickoff, and he drills it down. Let's see who it comes to. This is Cedric Mitter, who starts from his 10. And Mitter just takes it straight. Is he any good? His second touchdown reception of the night. Good for 26 yards. Conrad Holloway, 11 of 12 in passing, throws another strike to Greer. Leroy Paul and Terry Greer have been having a battle so far in this first half. Unquestionably, Terry Greer's winning that time, a 26-yard touchdown reception. The point after by Andrew Session is good. The Argos are back out in front. Well, we talked about it once again. We saw Terry Greer make a move and go by Leroy Paul earlier in the ballgame. Again, the same thing this time to the inside. It just shows the outstanding athletic ability of Terry Greer. Toronto 18, Hamilton 13. We'll be back in just a moment. They bought a new Nissan Sentra Wally. We need that wagon. Nissan Sentra. More power per pound than any other wagon with gas mileage this high. Room for a family of five. Six. Ah! We need it, Wally. New Nissan Sentra. You need this car. Let's get it, Doris. That's all we are you are looking at the most important innovation in gas home heating in 40 years, Lennox Pulse Heating. Take it from Dave Lennox. This new Lennox Pulse Furnace uses less gas, up to 42% less. It's the world's most efficient gas furnace. How about that? Atta boy, Dave! Call your independent Lennox dealer today. He knows the future belongs to the efficient. Rufus Crawford is number 21, Howard Field 16. They await the kickoff from Zen and Andrew Session as the Argos have gone back in front 18 to 13 with 6.55 left in the first half. Crawford allows the ball to go out of bounds. If you, well, that was a great throw by Clemens. He kept the ball low on an equally fine catch by Keith Baker because he had Don Rose all over him. I can tell you from our vantage point, it looked like the ball was a one hopper, but from our great isolation shot there we can see that it definitely was a good catch by Keith Baker Clements going for the marbles to Baker and is picked off by Darrell Wilson Wilson makes the interception at the seven yard line
Well, the first mistake of the ball game by Tom Clements. I think he was fooled by the Toronto Argonaut coverage. He was expecting man-to-man. -man. They were back deep in the zone. No chance for Keith Baker to catch this football. The only one that could was Darrell Wilson, and he makes the interception. With four minutes, 30 seconds left in the first half, Toronto 18, Hamilton 13. We'll be back in a moment. It's like a great day. What are you going to do? Play tennis. Get a new swing set. Anyone want to compare insurance policies? Wait. Allstate could make it worthwhile. And very easy. Just drop off your policies at Allstate the next time you're in Sears. And we're going to do everything to see if Allstate can give you a better value. Oh, got good news for you. You do? He does. Already? See what Allstate can do for you. Put yourself in good hands. It's going to be a great trip. Hi. Oh, hey. Hi. 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 No matter where people go, Conoco helps them get there. Our motor oils protect trucks over the long haul and farm equipment against the worst conditions. Have a good trip. A Conoco lubricant even protects the space shuttle. We use the same technology to make super and all-season motor oils for your car. Conoco, hottest brand going. An equally big one tomorrow when the Calgary Stampeders visit the Blue Bombers in Winnipeg. Who do you like in that one? Well, I don't know. A tough defensive team, Calgary. Great offensive team, Winnipeg. It's, it should be an excellent matchup. From the seven-yard line, Holloway has some time. Flags come down. We'll probably get a holding penalty against the Argos. Hamilton, 13. We'll be back in just a moment. Huddle is here, a preview of your area's conference teams. Huddle is loaded and it's free. Be game ready. Take a look at the players, plays, and coaches that make the difference each week. Quizzes, contests, and cheerleaders worth cheering about. Get in the habit of being informed. Huddle has it all every week and it's free. In the Atlantic Coast, Southeast, and Southwest conferences. Now at participating locations of these and other fine convenience stores. Look for Huddle free in your area soon. Well, I don't know what the official attendance will be tonight, but it's got to be over 50,000 because the entire park is jammed. I mean, everywhere you went in Toronto this week, it was, can you get me tickets to the Argo games? Last year, no conversation around town. Today, this week, everybody's talking about the double blue. All right, let's see what the Argos elect to do. Conrad Holloway is leaving the ball game. That means Zen and Andrew Session will be on. And I would think that you'll see a punt by Andrew Session here, which is exactly what he's going to do. There's no time remaining unless the big Z fakes this one. get to the end zone. David Shaw makes the catch and then he goes down at the five yard line and that is the final play of a most entertaining first half. The newcomer you see there Steve Kerr they're all getting a chance to show what they can do and you have to be impressed how Tom Clements operates this club. He's been good on 23 of 34 for 277 yards. Gives to Rufus Crawford, and Crawford is wrapped up early. The ball comes loose, but he may have gotten it back. As the gun sounds to win the third quarter of play, Hamilton retains possession. They are out in front of Toronto, 27 to 18. We'll return with the fourth quarter in a moment. League-leading Winnipeg Blue Bombers take to the field Saturday night when they line up to face Calgary in a CFL contest. Will the Stampeders be able to stop top quarterback Dieter Brock and his explosive bomber offense? See professional football from Canada Saturday night on ESPN. Every football fan thinks he's an expert before the opening kickoff. But with this book, the official 1982 Football Action Blue Book, you can be one of the lucky few who looks like an expert after the final gun is sounded. You're just a phone call away from owning the book that turns 
armchair quarterbacks into instant experts. Here are just some of the valuable facts in the Blue Book. The schedules and results of every pro and major college team for the last four years. Their 1982 schedules with workspace. Pro turnover and sack records. Returning starters and draftees. How teams do on different surfaces. And which coaches really give you the winning edge. Over 150 fact-filled pages. Call this toll-free number and examine the official 1982 Football Action Blue Book for two weeks. If it can't help you, return it for a complete refund. Major credit cards accepted. You won't find a more helpful football fact book anywhere. Your Total Sports Network, three times better and still growing strong. ESPN. Total first downs in the third quarter, Hamilton 12, Toronto 1. Hamilton with a second down and 11 to go from the Toronto 39. The pass intended for Di Pietro was broken up by Daryl Wilson. Don Moan. So it's Hamilton 30, Toronto 18. We'll be back in just a moment. From the edge of time comes the digital watch of tomorrow, today. The new Dress Digital by Timex. Incredibly thin digitals with a totally new technology. All push buttons are gone. Digital control is an amazing command bar. Discover the new, very beautiful, micro-thin Dress Digitals by Timex. Built and priced in the Timex tradition. Timex. We make technology beautiful. Saturday is full of sports on ESPN. Beginning with a high-powered action of a PKA full-contact karate bantamweight contenders bout. Later, heavyweight contender Jerry Cotzea puts on the gloves and steps in the ring against Stan Ward for the live main event on Saturday night at the fight. And the Winnipeg Blue Bombers will have to stay on their toes if they hope to outrun the Calgary Stampede in a CFL showdown. ESPN scores with more sports Saturday. Well, we were right. It is an all-time record crowd for Exhibition Stadium. Rincey is back to his 15-yard line. And he slips down as he gets to about the 23 or 24. A 61-yard boot by Bernie Ruoff. And only a 7-yard return by Carinci. And so the Argos start in a hole again. It is Hamilton 30, Toronto 18. We'll be back in just a moment. Four runs down. You want to concede to Michelob Light? Uh, you've done it now. Would good friends really go at it this hard just for a beer? Well, consider it's Michelob Light. And that means a rich, smooth taste you can compare to any beer you like. Hey, how'd you guys do it? Just concentrated on the fundamentals. The Michelob Light and who's buying it? Michelob Light. Compare the taste. Since the dawning of the automobile age, engine evolution has been related to engine revolution. As cars got bigger, so did their engines. And protecting these engines with the finest ingredients was a motor oil called Valvoline. Because today's smaller engines are revving higher and working harder, Valvoline's modern formulation is even tougher, helping prevent heat buildup and oil breakdown now and into the future. We call it survival of the fittest. Need some points and they need them in a hurry. Ten minutes left to play in the ball game. Hamilton 30, Toronto 18. First down Argos at their 23-yard line. Oh, they floated it up for Bob Braun, but there was so much pressure by the newcomer Will Simons. Uh, maybe it's a. Uh... Well, I guess if Freddie went in with them, Fred, who is the head trainer of the Argonauts, uh, must be some kind of problem with him. 21 of 37 is Conrad Holloway. He needs another one here, second and 10 from the 37-yard line of the Ticats. The pass was very nearly picked off by Carm Cartieri again. It was intended for Dave Newman, but that's two that Cartieri has very nearly come up with. Carm Carteri could have our Carling Defensive Player of the Game Award all locked up if he could catch the football. His second chance, as Pat mentioned, really 
Dave Newman did a good job, brought his hands back and try and broke it up as well, but it's got to be frustrating for Carteri. You know, there's not too many chances. Linebackers get the ball, but he yep. had a good chance there. With six minutes and 12 seconds to go, the Argos are going to go for it on third and 10. They trail by 12. Ball is at the Hamilton 37-yard line. The catch is made by Kerry Greer for the first down at the 22-yard line. Kerry Greer has done every single thing you could ask of a receiver tonight. He gives the Argos a very, very necessary first down. So it is Hamilton 30, Toronto 18. And let's see now what the Argos can do with a first down at the Hamilton 21. They gambled on third and 10. taste that won't go to your waste. Great day. What are you going to do? Play tennis. Get a new swing set. Anyone want to compare insurance policies? Wait. Allstate could make it worthwhile. And very easy. Just drop off your policies at Allstate the next time you're in Sears. And we're going to do everything to see if Allstate can give you a better value. Oh, hmm. got good news for you. You do? He does. Already? See what Allstate can do for you. Put yourself in good hands. Aliens have taken over the Earth. Every moving vehicle is theirs, and so is the land. You and you alone have captured one of their flying saucers. Can you beat the aliens with their own machine? You can. If you're fast, if you're accurate, if you don't lose your nerve, you are the space jockey. The fate of the Earth is in your hands. Yours in this new cartridge from U.S. Games. Space jockey. Fly it if you can. Space jockey. Beat it if you can. Space jockey. Sweaty palms are guaranteed with U.S. Games. Holloway, despite the fact that he is having injury problems, as you pointed out, Pat, is back here exhorting his offense, stating that we still have a chance. So hang on, we'll get that ball back, and we've got a chance. Tommy Clements is dragged down back at the 30-yard line by Jeff Gabrielson. Holloway was going for Greer. There is contact made by Leroy Paul. And I think we're going to have an interference call. The 
but it may be against the Argos. Let's wait and see. Tough call at this point in the ball game. We'll have to see how Ross Perrier sorts this whole thing out, but it appears it's against Terry Greer. And wait till you hear the fans' reaction to this one. Offensive pass interference, number 10, Toronto. Well, let's say this right now. The Argos haven't had too many breaks in this ball game. No, they really haven't. Uh, there was a touchdown call back by Darrell Wilson when it was a very early whistle. The ball definitely came through. Then there was that clipping penalty against Dave Newman that negated the touchdown by Terry Greer. But there's still a minute 33 left in the game. It is second and 20 Argos back at the Hamilton 39. They trail by 12 points. Holloway going for Newman. He makes the touchdown catch. Captivated this town this year. They just won't quit. The point after by Andrew Session is good. And now it's Hamilton 30, Toronto 25, with a minute 25 left in the ball game. Conrad Holloway has been good on 26 of 45 passes for 450 yards and three touchdowns. Chevrolet Celebrity. The bright new shape of Chevrolet Celebrity. The handling of front-wheel drive, the comforts of a larger car come together. Now you can enjoy high mileage in a front-wheel drive car with room, comfort, and quiet. Celebrity. Now offered with low 12.8% financing on new celebrities, delivered through May 31st. Celebrity. Come drive the bright new shape of Chevrolet. Kathy, spell ventriloquist. Ventriloquist. V-E-N-T-R-I-L-O-Q-U-I-S-T. Correct, you're the new champion. Please oh. just call up and share your joy. Yeah, Beth, I spell ventriloquist. Ventriloquist? I'd have trouble spelling dummy. Mm. Reach up, reach up, touch someone. Last year, swarms of gypsy moth caterpillars ruined yards and made thousands of people angry. They were on the trees, the house, even the car. I could hear them crunching at night. But new raid gypsy moth and Japanese beetle killer kills bugs fast. Just a twist mixes the concentrate and shoots a trace of foam into trees and shrubs to kill bugs on contact. New raid gypsy moth and Japanese beetle killer kills bugs dead with just a twist. Opposed to doing it in this situation, I think you have to keep the ball away from the tight end offense. By the way, gentlemen, not only is Dave Newman hurting, but so is Conrad Holloway. He's having a real tough time getting his breath on the sidelines. He's back here at the bench, but says he will go in if they get that ball again. Well, they kick deep to Keith Baker on his three-yard line. And Baker is finally forced out at the 27-yard line with 1.17 left on the clock. They're down to a minute three, and a first down here would virtually snuff out any Argo chance. Clements carries himself. And we'll wait and see the placement of the ball. Ticat players indicating that it is a first down. All right, Tommy has thrown the ball 37 times tonight. 25 receptions, 294 yards, and two touchdowns. All right, the tie cats are short. It's your turn. Now what do you oh, do? You've got to punt the ball. Well, they're not going to punt it. 
Well. Alex Martin, what would you do? Punt it away. I would have punted it away, too. But that's why we're all enjoying this game here. Watching it rather than playing it. Clemens keeps it himself. And I don't know. Boy, this is going to be close. Great surge by that defensive line of the Argonauts. 35 seconds shot. left, incidentally. Leon Laskavich and Fred Norgan, the two tackles, plug that up. We'll have to wait and see if they make it. It's going to be close. I think they've got it. That's the ball game. Stevenson, I'm sure, had something to do with that because he was almost mobbed to death. Last time we did a game here. Clemens takes it, drops to one knee, and now this will be the final play of the ball game because there's only 14 seconds left. The Hamilton Tie Cats have moved back to within one point of the Toronto Argonauts. They hand the Argos their second loss of the season to the Tie Cats. The Argos have lost three now, and this is their first loss here at Exhibition Stadium. Time has expired. Tommy Clemens takes it, goes down on one knee, and the ball game is over. The Hamilton Tie Cats have defeated the Toronto Argonauts 30 to 25. CTV's Friday Night Football will continue in a moment. Here come the survivors from Samsonite. Tough, rugged luggage you can save 20 to 40% on right now. Save on good-looking Silhouette 2. The light yet rugged kicks. Stylish, easy packs too. And Samsonite Sleek Classic 4 attaches. All at 20 to 40% off. The Samsonite Survivors on sale now. Arby's launches a great new submarine sandwich. Wave after wave of ham and salami. Gobs and gobs of pepperoni and Swiss cheese. Shredded lettuce, tomatoes, onions. And special Italian dressing on a long, hard-baked Italian roll. You can't sink your teeth into a better sub for the price in the USA. The sub is one of Arby's four new deli specialties from Arby's. America's roast beef, yes, sir. The phrase continues for chariots of fire. Winner of four Academy Awards, including Best Picture. The Best Picture of the Year is Chariots of Fire. Playing everywhere, rated PG. Let's keep the good times rolling. When GMAC rolled back car and truck financing rates to 12.8%, we started something big, a great opportunity to save hundreds of dollars. Get your new GM car or light-duty truck by May 31st at just 12.8%. But hurry, time's running out. See your participating GM dealer for qualification details now. Save with 12.8% GMAC financing and keep the good times rolling. If you're looking for a great donut, where do you look? The donuts in supermarkets could have been there for a week. And the variety, there isn't any. And frozen donuts, well... At Dunkin' Donuts, we make our donuts fresh by hand, day and night. We'd never serve you donuts that are more than hours old. Because they usually don't stay around that long anyway. Warning, pollen can trigger bronchial asthma attacks. Be prepared with Primatine Mist. Primatine, the fastest type relief known for occasional attacks. Restores free breathing in as fast as 15 seconds. Or, to keep breathing freely for hours, Primatine tablets. In the lungs, Primatine opens clogged breathing tubes, relaxes bronchial spasms, restores free breathing. Primatine Mist, the fastest type relief known. 
Primatine Tablets contains the asthma reliever doctors recommend most. Sometimes late in the evening, an emotion begins to stir in men. A craving for excitement that can be satisfied only one way. ESPN, the 24-hour cable sports network. Big-time sports like college football and basketball, NBA basketball, professional boxing, auto racing, something exciting and even at 1 in the morning. ESPN, the 24-hour cable sports network where the cheering never stops.